What's up, YouTube? I'm unboxing my bioactive kit for my 40 breeder from Josh Halter, the bio dude. I told you guys I was going to do this, and let's unbox it. Let me do this without showing you guys. Ah. 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 You see? This is my. Bearded Dragons. Power of Lulu. Alright, so here we have the bio dude. This is the bio shot. You see? We got our Stagnamoss. We got our Leaf Litter Biodegradables. We got another pack of biodegradables and the famous Terra Sahara. It's heavy. I'm sorry, I'm on the ground too. Turtle. Famous Terra Sahara. And since I'm by myself, I will leave the camera go and show you guys how this looks after when I. Add this, and I'm. I let it get a little dirty because I knew the biopsy set of kit was coming through, so don't mind me. And I'll show you another video when it's about done. Out of the tank, so I can add this bioactive setup. I've been wanting to try for the longest now, so I'll keep. I'm by myself, so I wish I could do the whole step, but we'll manage. And I'm gonna give this a little cleaning with. Your wipe out and I'm gonna keep having you guys post it, you know? And I'm gonna keep the camera tilted so you could watch. If it uns, it, that means it fell or whatever. Terra Terra is going in now. This is funny, guys. Read it by the way, it's a custom tank. That's a lot of soil. Alright, so I'm gonna even it all out now. This soil feels fine, damn. This soil feels good, what the hell? This is not a regular soil, because I have soil, com earthworm compost and stuff. This feels different. This feels different. It feels moist too. What? This is different. This video binge watching OD. Uh, now I'm gonna lightly water, water it. I mean, heavy water, I guess. Until you see puddles. Until you see puddles. I mean, pools on the top. Yeah, I think that's about. That's about good. And we're gonna mix it. Put you guys here. Let me put you guys here. Mix it all through. Mix it all through the substrate. Like Josh Halton said, this is not supposed to be sand. It's just like the rough terrains they live in. So, yo, this this soil, no joke. I'm not even joking just because I bought it, but this soil will feel good. I'm not going to lie to you guys. So we mix it through. All right. Feel good as hell. You going? It's like it's better than play though. Shit. Yeah. So I put the soil. Shit. Big that of however they want. And now it's time for the bio shot. Bow. This is difficult if I tell you. Alright. You want to evenly distribute it around the whole vivarium. 
What the Bioshock does is a supplement that's beneficial, that gives beneficial microorganisms and uh, nutrients for a bioactive viraria. Bow. All right, so just mix it in. It has a little smell to it. Has to be. Need any more cleanup crew. I have earthworms I've been breeding. This is the compost. That's how I told you I know the difference between the soil. And I'll put the earthworms at my cleanup crew right now until my. I ordered purple dwarf off of eBay. And until they come, my earthworms will be the cleanup crew. And all right. some earthworms there. That's enough until my isopods come. Let these earthworms go. Let them be a little treat for them. Until my isopods come. And let's continue. YouTube is in two days since I set up my bioactive vibrarium. And all I'm waiting now is for my isopods to come in. Dwarf purples. I'll buy the rest of the isopods as time goes and spring tells, you know. And... The, um, I've been digging this uh, enclosure. I'm liking this. Oh my god, it looks so natural. And if you watch the whole well, the video, I'm gonna put it all together. I was breathing heavy in the other videos because my bronchitis was starting to kick up. So don't mind me breathing heavy like that, man. Please. <laughs> and this is Lou. This is Cairo, and this is the bioactive viraria. Peace.